Hello and welcome to the Swedish Country Life. Today I'm going to show off my new purchase. It's a Hamron battery operated electric pump. So this is the package that it came in. Portable tire pump for use with cars, bikes, Li-Ion battery rechargeable. It got a display, LED lights, three different nozzle adapters, rechargeable tire pump that is suitable for most pumping tasks. And how does it look then? First we got our instruction manual. Then we got a little bag with the three nozzle adapters. We got a little pooch bag we can place it in just to keep it around. Here we got the nozzle, a quite small one I got to say, but it works. And then here we got the unit. To start it we press the on button in three seconds. It lights up and says on. If you press the U button, the light turns on. Really nice. To change the use unit you are going to use it on, you press the M button. First we got the car, then the bike, bicycle, the ball, then we got the special button. I don't know what special is, but if you feel a little special, you can probably use it. <laughs> if you press the U button, you can change between the bar, KPA, Chilo per square centimeter, PSI, and bar again. You raise it with the plus, you lower it with the minus. Just press one to start, just press again to stop. I would recommend to use this if you want to use it too. <laughs> you just screw it on. There we go. It's really easy to use. It's really simple. And to turn it off, you just press the off button three seconds. At first I was a little skeptic. It was so tiny, but uh, it feels robust. Could you really pump a car tire with this one? I, I didn't know, but uh, it had a great review on it. Uh, everybody liked it and was impressed. So I thought that, yeah, I, I gave it a try anyway. And so far I have had it for a few days now and I'm really impressed. It was when we were off to a zoo that we took our stroller. We hadn't used it for about uh, one year, I think. We threw it in the car and we used it when we were on place. And when my wife tried it out, she said that, Oh, we got a flat tire here. Oh, and that one too. And that, oh, all four wheels were flat. So uh, that was it. I just needed to buy something to pump our tires with. I went on the net and I searched for a tire pump and uh, I found this one. It cost 60 bucks and uh, I thought that it's quite much, but uh, if it works, I'm really going to be using it. It's for emergency uses and uh, just uh, basic needs uh, at home. Get rid of those hand pumping uh, tools that you can uh, pump with your foot or that you need to use your whole body with. Let's try it out on the car here. Uh, my wife wanted me to check the tires here and uh, yeah. This will be perfect for that. All right, so I'm going to do the whole car here. And first I <laughs> remove this plug here. Then we got a threaded uh, rounded tip here that you just put it on. We start it. Oh, ow. I need to get something. Uh, it hurts my legs to uh, just be on the gravel here. So uh. here we go. A little padding for my legs. <laughs> it will be much better. Ah, there we go. All right. So first, I chose the car button. It's on 2.2 bar. I'm going to place it on 2.3 bar. Then I just uh, press the on button. Ah, 
and there we go that was the first one so let's do the other ones and we will speed it up now i think <laughs> And there we go. It isn't the fastest one, but uh, you can do it uh, at home. And uh, I think that's an important thing. And you don't need to go to the nearest petrol station where they have uh, those um, air pressure testers <laughs> or what they are called. So uh, th I think it's really nice to have one uh, where you can uh, use it. If you don't have a compressor that is, uh, those are so much better. Let's try something else to pump it up, uh, see what it goes for. So I'm thinking 60 bucks is quite much just to uh, check your tires with, but uh, what more scenarios can you use it on? And then I'm thinking about uh, balls and uh, those. Uh, when you're on the beach and you need to put those uh, safety thingies on your child, and I also found a blowable ball, <laughs> something you can play with in the water. So on the beach and uh, perhaps the balls at home. And with me, I got my little <laughs> tools here, all the accessories that it come with. We got the small one you can use on the balls. We got this one. I have no idea if it's on bicycle tires, perhaps. And also this one, uh, the little proby one that you can probably use really good on this yeah <laughs> but first uh, I'm thinking about blowing up the balls who doesn't like to get their balls blown so <laughs> let's see if this works first yeah and uh, just for fun I'm going to take all the air out and uh, do it from the ground There we go. It doesn't have so much air in it, but uh, I'm going to take it away and away. That's one way to squeeze out the balls. Ah. And this one. I don't think you can blow it. So, yeah, let's get rid of that one and just take this. We attach the ball blower thing there. Insert the ball blower thing and I'm choosing the ball option and it says 0 0.5 bar. Let's start with that and see if we can blow more or how much it needs. There you go. The red is starting to swell. 0 0.1. <laughs> wow. Ah. 0 0.2, 3. Wow. 4. Yeah, I think 4 is enough. That was really fast. Work. Now let's see this one. This is even more emptier. Insert 0 0.5. Uh, I'm going to take 0 0.3 this time. I don't know about this one. This is an old one. Shoe the little. So we'll see. Ah. Really fast. Mm, perfect. <laughs> Zero point three. Wow, I'm really impressed. Now let's see about the beach. Then this is a 
bigger ball and we got the floating things on the, your arms too. Let's get rid of this. And it's starting to rain now. Nice. So let's be quick here. <laughs> there. Screw the probe thing in. Insert it. We raise it to 0.3 bar here too. And let's see. I don't, don't uh, dare to do more than that. It's 0.0, .0 but it's really filled anyway. Perhaps 0 0.1, but... Oh, okay. It did work without any problem. So let's do the arm things now. <laughs> it didn't take any time at all. Wow. <laughs> Imagine you. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Just a couple of seconds. Imagine you put this on your child and do this on the beach with all the people around. They are really going to wonder what are you doing with the, the child. But oh, wow, that was fast. So, one more time. I'll do it here. On myself. Ah. There we go, and another one. Ah! Oh! <laughs> don't! I, I don't know. Uh, perhaps you shouldn't do it on the, these things. Uh, you can rather blow with your mouth, but. I can feel it. It's a little st stretching my arm now. Ah. But uh, <laughs> yeah, on your child, they will be ah! no problem at all. It was really fast, I think, and uh, it's still four plups on the battery. So uh, yeah, it got some juice in it left, and that's good. <laughs> Even works on cats. <laughs> Let's try a, a tire too. How long will an entire tire go from zero to full? Let's try that one. Yeah. All right, so here we got the tire. It's fully blown. I have actually used it to blow up this, but uh, just for the video's sake, uh, I'm going to empty all the air from it first and then we're going to try it <laughs> okay so here i got my compressor let's empty it out it has 2.4 about so i'm going to empty it now All right, there we go. It is as flat as I can make it right now, I think. Nothing is piecing out, so yeah. And uh, yeah, it's still a little in it perhaps, but uh, it's as flat as you can get it uh, that you don't want to have it. <laughs> so <laughs> now let's try the little pump and see what it can do. Plug it in and see what it says, how much is left in it. There we go. And we are going to show choose the car first. 2.3 and it's 0, 0. So yeah, no pressure there. And start. All right.
and there we go <laughs> it just started to pour down and uh, yeah i don't think it's good for it to get wet and suck in any moisture but uh, yeah it took some time and it isn't meant to be replaced by an ordinary compressor or something like that but for when you're stranded you really need it you are going to love it at home yeah you can go and take a coffee or two <laughs> but uh, it works and uh, i'm really uh, satisfied about it I, I must really say that i can really recommend to have one of those it isn't sponsored at all i don't recommend just this one i recommend that you have one of these at home there are so many br brands i'm really going to use it uh, any time i can <laughs> i like those small trinkets that you can uh, uh, charge up you can uh, charge it via the little cable that comes with it through the usb connection and uh, that's really good to have almost all cars nowadays have a usb connection and uh, yeah it's so small so you can have it in your trunk in your car if you just happen to need it if you got one of these please tell me what you think about it but anyway that's it <laughs> i need to go inside now really pours thank you for watching see you next time bye bye Ah! Oh!